What's up today, my fellow Madden soldiers? So what I'm going to be going over right now is what you guys should be doing to get ready for season four. I want to make sure that I prepare you guys because some of you guys are asking me like, hey, how do you go about getting your coins? How should I get coins? What should I do? And so forth. So there's things you could do right now if you want to start accumulating coins. However, if you already did everything, the best thing you could do right now is get ready for season four. And I'm going to show you guys all that right now because that's going to give you guys tons of cards, coins, and other stuff. Because I really hope that EA is going to go all out. I mean, Madden's going to go all out, I should say, when it comes to the season four. But we'll see because there's going to be tons of stuff that, that I, I'm going to let you guys know right now when it comes to the season four. So anyways... Let me go ahead and start off with the store offers and then I'm going to go to the solos right now and I'm going to show you guys pivotal things that you might you guys may not think that's important but it's going to be important. But let's go over here first. All right. So we want to go to special offers and in special offers, don't worry about these cuz these are going to these are going to stay there just to let you guys know that but what you guys want to pay attention to, okay, these three are going to stay there. These other ones right here are not going to stay here. I don't know how yours is because I bought quite a few packs as I leveled up. But some of you guys, either you haven't fully leveled up yet. And if you have, some of you guys probably have all your special offers still av available. So at this point in the game, to me, it's not worth it to get this 97 overall ultimate legend boss for 2200. It's just not worth it right now. 97 overalls are very cheap. This $5 fantasy pack, it's worth it if you want, like, say, Bo Jackson and stuff like that. Uh, I'm, I might consider, I don't know, but it'll be good if you want to power him up, okay? But, however, there's already a 99 gold Bo Jackson. Why would you want to power him up? He's, he's only going to get Raider Kim, so just I would just keep him. Some of you guys might power him up because he might get the Bo's No Kim, but I heard recently that the Bo don't even get the Bo No Kim, or if you power him up, it don't even activate, or he don't even have it. So that's kind of ridiculous. If they fix it, then it's worth powering them up. If they don't, then it's not going to be worth powering them up. But if you want one of these players just in order to get their, you know, 25 bucks and go ahead and get it, I might get it just to have it. But in the end, it really, because it's only $5. But in the end, um, if you get to spend coins to get that instead on the auction block, then go ahead and get that. Unless that player is going for a lot. But I'm not tripping on these. But you guys may have a lot of them. The only one I'll encourage you guys to get is the coin offers because they have like a $5 um elite fantasy pack it's, it's a platinum pack and you get it you get you pay five bucks you get two of them you get two packs so it's basically two for the price of one so that's worth getting because you're guaranteed some coins i would get those any platinum packs i will get but that's about it though don't touch anything i wouldn't get anything else unless you guys want to go ahead and get it save your coins because a lot of cards are going to go a lot lower and you don't know what you're going to get in season four that's if you still have those cards right now also in season four, there's going to be new special offers. And I'm pretty sure the special offers are going to be good. There might be power up passes. I'm pretty sure there's going to be some good platinum um, card packs. And then other card, like uh, like maybe another ultimate legend and stuff like that. Maybe even a go I'm really thinking at level 50, they're going to offer us a golden ticket. I don't see why not. You know, especially if they're, they're already cheap. So keep all that in mind. All that's going to be coming um when it comes to season four so i just want to put that out there right now i wouldn't be wasting that much money on the game if you're gonna plan to spend money do not go all out wait for season four be until you see what the store offers are so you get the store offers or you can do both i mean if you guys just want to keep on you know um spending money that's fine if that's what you guys want to do but i'll encourage you guys to be patient and wait for that to see what they got to offer now this is very important what i'm about to tell you right now is season four this is very this is a hundred percent important you see right here how i have some of these solos not complete the forge is not i mean i don't think it's gonna we see when is it gonna change i don't think that, this is the last forge so i don't think it's gonna change so that's even better see i have all these solos still available me available to me the only ones i played is the ones that i needed to play in order to get certain players that i want to get but if i didn't care about the players i look at super bowl present i saved a lot of these solos so if you guys haven't did your solos yet and you're already leveled up, save these solos. Because when season four comes around, these solos are going to help you get to level 50 faster. All right. So every star equals 200 train. So if I got five stars for completing a solo, even if it's 20, even if it's five second solo, I get a thousand uh, XP. I said 200 train. 200 XP, I mean. So it's, it's 200 XP each star. I said 200 training. I got a little confused. But anyways, so five stars would be a, a thousand XP. So that's good. No, the thing is, 200 XP is for each star. 
So you're gonna level up a lot faster if you guys hold on to these solos, if you don't need to level up no more. If you guys still wanna level up, then yeah, go ahead and continue, start doing some of these solos. But I'm gonna be honest, even then, this far into the game, it's not even worth leveling up that far. I'll say go level level up all the way to like 30, and basically just in order for you guys to get the platinum packs in the store. But besides that, it's not even worth it to level up right now because a lot of the offers that they're offering is not really that like OP right now. I'd rather save your solos for season four because they're gonna offer a lot of stuff right from the start. You know, you don't even have to level up that far in order to get some decent packs, cards, and coins. So if it was my opinion, if you haven't went to level 50, level up only up until you get those platinum packs for a discount, and that's it. All right, the rest of the stuff is not really worth it. I'm gonna tell you right now, this far into the game, save your save your solos for season four, so you guys can level up a lot faster. You see, I, I even got some Ultimate Legend solos. I'm gonna do them because I'm, we're gonna get another free fantasy pack. These these uh, tokens they give us, they're they're we can actually do them over again. They said they're repeatable, so we're basically gonna end up with another free Legend fantasy pack as we do them. And you could do them many times. So I'm gonna go back and do all those. I'm gonna be grinding like crazy, right? And it's crazy it's so far into the game right now that it's almost Madden 23. But I'm actually enjoying it right now. This is the first time in Madden that I actually enjoy play the game. Unlike previous Madden's, like around this time, I really didn't care for it. But right now, yeah, I'm actually enjoying it. And I'm, I'm enjoying the fact also that you guys are enjoying this actual, I mean, this Dallas Cowboy theme team. And I appreciate you guys' support. So that's another reason I'm doing this video. I really I haven't have did, did, did videos like this in a minute. I've been doing a lot of Dallas Cowboy theme team videos, but I want to make sure because a lot of you guys are asking me and I want to make sure that I get this information out to you guys when it comes to um, the solos and everything else. Cam Chouncers are already maxed out. So keep in mind, they're gonna give us another, what, season master and, and they're gonna get some other players with like champions and stuff like that. I forgot what, what they are, but we're gonna be getting some decent players. I, I I wonder who they are, but we're gonna be getting some decent players, so I can't wait. Um, I mean, I don't even know who, who they might, might give us, but I know they're gonna be decent. Hope, ho I'm hoping at least 299 overalls are gonna give us free, maybe three, but I'm hoping two. I know not one for sure, but I'm hoping, I'm hoping three. And then we're gonna get power passes. I'm pretty sure we're gonna get 99 power pass, a 98 power pass, um, 97s and stuff like that. But anyways, so you see all these objectives. Once, once we get season four, these objectives are gonna basically see. I already completed all the objectives, so I got everything. So these are gonna actually, you know, cross over. Not cross over, but I mean, they're gonna be done with, and new ones are gonna be new objectives are gonna be there. So we're gonna get a tons of stuff, like I was telling you, a lot of rewards, and it's gonna help you guys get your coins, help build your team up, and have fun with it at least until Madden 23. That's why I believe EA is gonna juice up these. Um, the season four if they don't it'd be kind of silly, but I believe so because I mean really towards the end of the game Just keep let us just keep people let let us keep playing it until Madden 23 comes out and then uh, just yeah, just juice up everything I, if they go all out I'll be happy, but that's really about it so three things to keep in mind the store offers we're gonna get the solos Make sure I, I would save them for now until season four so you guys could get level up a lot faster because they're going to help you level up a lot faster. And then these ultimate season, you know, these objectives and all that stuff are basically going to they're, they're, they're going to end and the new ones are going to come. So just to let you guys know that. So then one of the three things to let you guys know, players are probably going to go down, things like that. Cars are going to go down. So save your coins until then. I wouldn't waste no co more coins right now until the season four starts. But anyways, then one of the main things that I want to share with you guys, because I know some of you guys will want to know, and then we're the best way right now to prepare for season four. Just wait and be patient. I'm going to leave it right here. If you guys like seeing what you drop a like on the video. If you guys need sub subs to the channel, there will be more great amazing content coming your way. Thank you guys all for tuning in. I'm